Hey what's going on guys, it's Kusin Tech here and today I'm gonna show you which are the best gaming performance settings so that your games will run in a bit higher frames per second. As always, all the links will be in the description, so are you ready? Alright, first we need to make sure that we have the latest version for our drivers. To do so, we have two options. We can download the driver manually, or we can use the G4 Experience software, which can check for updates and also give us a screen recorder in case we need to. It's called Shadowplay. First, let's go to this link. This page is in case you don't want to use the G4 Experience and want to download the driver yourself. So first we need to make sure which model is our GPU. If you don't know, just right click in the taskbar, then task manager, performance tab, and here we have our GPU. Mine is a GeForce GTX 1060. Close. The type, the series, the model, the Windows version, the language, and always choose recommended. Click search. And here you have the latest version, always in the top. In case you want to use the G4 experience, go to this page and hit download. Once downloaded, let's go and open the file. Click install. Once in this page, you can create a new NVIDIA account or you can log in with a Gmail or Facebook account. The Gmail option is the best. So once in this page, uncheck this box and click skip. To check for drivers updates, click drivers. And if you have a new version, it will appear here. If not, you can click check for updates. Now let's open the NVIDIA control panel. Right click, NVIDIA control panel. Here click this option and move the bar all the way to the left. Then hit apply. Let's open Manage 3D Settings. Select your GPU. If you turn on this option, the image quality will be better, but you will see a few frame drops, like 3 or 5. If so, click here, click on, here 0 0.5, here 0. Thank you. Then hit OK. Ambient occlusion off. Anisotrophic filtering off. FX AA off. Gamma correction on. Mode off. CUDA GPU. Make sure your GPU is selected. Max frame rate. With this option, you can limit the maximum frame rate your games will have. If so, click here. Click on and choose your maximum frame rate. If not, cancel and leave it off. Multi-frame sample AA, leave it off. OpenGL rendering GPU, select your GPU. Power Management Mode, Maximum Performance. Shader Catch, on. Anisotrophic Sample, on. Negative LLD Bias, allow. Quality, Maximum Performance.
Trilineal Optimization Off. Thread Optimization On. Triple Buffering Off. Vertical Sync Off. Virtual Reality Pre-Render Frames 1. Then hit Apply. Now click on Physics Configuration. Select your GPU. Then hit Apply. Next, click on Adjust Video Color Settings. NVIDIA Settings. Then here, click Full. Then hit Apply. So far, so good, but there is another option. In order to gain access to the option, we need an application called NVIDIA Inspector. Let's go to this web page. Scroll down and hit download. To extract the file, we need WinRAR. Let's go to this page. Hit download. Choose your language. Then hit download. Let's open the files. First, install WinRAR. Right-click on Embedding Inspector and hit Extract. Open this. And here we have two exit files. The one we need is this one, Embedding Profile Inspector. Here we only need to change one thing, maximum pre-render frames. Click here and choose one, then hit apply. You don't need to have this application opened in order for this to work. Also depending on which PC game you are trying to run, you can click here and search for the name. If you find it, then click it then hit apply. In that specific game, we'll gain some kind of performance boost. If you want to turn this off, then click here and choose global settings. Then hit apply. That's all for now guys. If you find this video useful, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future videos. But more important, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.